the wood we use for making clogs is well over poplar in this case it's poplar. If you pay good attention, you can make yourself a pair at home. <laughs> Are you still going to Switzerland? Yeah. Well, you can pick up a little Swiss army knife and go. Earlier. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, this isn't a cooking program, is it? <laughs> <laughs> so on, a, on average, how long does it take you to make one? It depends on my physical state. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Last night I tried to drown myself in vodka Red Bull. Oh. So I'm not too strong today. <laughs> It didn't work though, I might have to try again tonight. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Come to the most dangerous bit of making the clothes. If this goes wrong, no babies for me in the future. It's <laughs> <laughs> not funny, that's ouch. <laughs> you can imagine though, the Dutch were quite inventive, so he also invented some protection. <laughs> There's only one problem with it. Too many beautiful girls and the shoe turns around. Stop <laughs> <laughs> <Help> me! <laughs> So did I tell you guys about the great variety of clocks already? <laughs> no? Uh, well, we have a great variety of clocks in Holland. <laughs> <laughs>
Now this there is a fisherman shoe, you can recognize that's pointy nose. The fisherman uses the point to pick up his nets without bending over all the time. Mm -hmm. You can imagine that the fisherman was very happy at that invention. <laughs> bending over in the harbors? <laughs> Not a good idea. <laughs> this is a farmer's shoe, it's got a round nose, which makes them a little bit more cow friendly. <laughs> this one is very special, this is a wedding shoe. It was tradition when a boy wanted to marry a girl, he had to carve her a pair like these. Oh. <laughs> Let's try that again. <laughs> it took him about four weeks, but it did give him some extra time to think it over again. Now once we've cut them, there's three ways we can dry them. We can let them dry naturally, takes about two weeks. We can also kiln dry them, takes about 24 hours. But the hardest way to actually dry them is to blow on them. <laughs> you can imagine, I can only do that ten times a day. <laughs> After that, I drop dead. <laughs> Alright guys, then I've got a special request. Can you all smile please? Does that hurt? No, huh? <laughs> Come here then, little wet, white head. Mm. <laughs> little white head. <laughs> Don't worry, <laughs> you're not going to be on a mission. That's for your smile. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thank you very much for your attention, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.